What's up, everybody? Thanks for tuning in to Jeezy TV. I'm Juju. Today is Saturday, April 20th, so that means it's 420. So that's a national holiday to a lot of y'all, but not to me. I don't sleep, but happy 420 to the people that do. I'm going to take a shot for y'all. And aside from it being 420, I have a lot of stuff to do today. Like, I'm going to go get these nails done. And I have a birthday party to go to, and today is fight night, so that means Terrence Crawford, Omaha stand up, you know. So, anywho, I'm going to take y'all along for that, and stay tuned. Stevenson, we want Stevenson to win. I can show somebody my laptop. Yeah. Energy. Well, here we are. Yeah. 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 Y
Mike Evans in your TV. Who do you think gonna win the fight? Electrical, because what did they say? But always put your rounds when they knock this weak chin ass underneath. You put them under. We're just gonna continue getting drunk. He's got his TV right here. But he's like, oh, my line is over there. Let's see what they talking about. I'm gonna put it under the carpet over here. So that means the whole carpet is holding current. It's not like that. This is what they call it. That's why you have. That's why you have rubber on the bottom of the That's right. And that's why that's always that's why they always say if you're in a place or in a working environment where if there's any type of electricity, you hit somebody with like a stick or something else. You don't use nothing steel or flat because it it, it it carries current. You hit them with something like that that doesn't carry current. Well, I know I'll be in the office. You know what I'm saying? You gotta hit them. Flashy too. You can touch a live wire. This one, rubber, this one never carry current. That I do. Yeah, nothing plastic, nothing like that, though. Yeah, you got it. Woohoo! You want to leave? Mm -hmm. <laughs> he don't belong here. He know he don't belong here. He like, they black. Black people don't have cats. And they got two of them. Yeah, he want to go. Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> If bad, I do that in the middle of the good part of the right. I don't even like it. Cat. That's what the fuck is that? Who's his ass, man? Who's his ass, man? Who's his ass, can I have a hook? Ooh. She don't mess with you. Oh. Uh, no, it's not the time for this.
But he don't want to win like that. that. Blood is mad now. because he don't want to win like that. He wants to win me. And I'm pretty sure he's going to say it. That's his mama. I mean, we can see that. Yeah. And that's his baby mama. We know Isha. We know her. She done lost some weight. 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 Right, you already knew he about to get there. And it seemed like the bell saved him. What was your impression of the Amir Khan that came out from the second round on? Well, I didn't want to, I was rushing myself a little bit. I was trying to uh, box more and just catch up with my uh, uh, in the churches. And that's to the side. I can see he didn't match his image, bro. I mean, everybody wants to know about pound for pound. I mean, it do hurt. Don't get me wrong. That shit hurts. They called the boogeyman at 147. That shit hurts. That's what I wanted to know. Talk to me about what you want next. Who, who is the boogeyman at 47? Carol Spence. Yes. I'm ready. I'm here. And he won't fight him. Make that happen. Make all the mix. He won't fight him though. How bad do you want this fight? Like I told you in the interview, I can't put a gun to the promoters in here and make them make the fights. So the only thing I can do is continue fighting every person they put in front of me, and we're going to make it happen sooner or later. The man who can make it happen, thank you very much, but They won't fight him. He's right here, Bob Arum. No doubt that Terrence wants this fight. How will this fight happen against Daryl Spence? All right, right. How can we make, how can you make the fight? You heard him. That man owns everything. Oh, Arum Spence. Well, listen, we want to fight Errol Spence. Terrence wants, a, I think Errol wants a fight. There's one guy that's stopping it, and that's Al Heyman. And every boxing fan should refuse to patronize Heyman.